Hi YouTubers, this is Lonnie Clark again. Here's my little file that I have sitting on my desk with all the numbers. This is actually FAIR reporting us so I can call the television stations. But I'm going to zip copy again. I don't think you can see that, but that's Ron Wyden. He's my senator. And after I posted that video, I was able to get through on Friday. So I'm going to call his office and see if it's a real thing. They've really unblocked my number. And I'm going to video record what I have to say to him today. Because the news coming out of Fukushima freaked me out. goes on. Senator Wyden's office? Uh, yes, this is Lonnie Clark and I live in Eugene, Oregon. And I am calling about uh, the news that came out of Fukushima today that uh, TEPCO's admitted that they haven't decontaminated anything and they're not able to do it. And I actually am super concerned. I know this is one of the items that Ron Wyden really pays attention to. But I'd like to know what the American government is doing about it. Like if there's something going, you know, I feel like we're being left like ducks, you know, sitting ducks to just be slammed with who knows what kind of catastrophe could be happening. So I'd like to figure out if there's any way to get a response or where I could go to access some information on what the government is actually doing about Fukushima. Uh, okay, so I should, what department sh of the state should, maybe the energy department or the state department, do you think? Okay, so I need to call the state department. Would I call, like, uh, maybe the ambassador, you know, Carolyn Kennedy's the ambassador to Japan, would that work, her office, would she know? I mean, if you say I should call the State Department, what, what office do you think I should start with? That's a huge, if I just Google it and find the State Department, there's a ton of different offices. And then maybe the Ambassador's office will tell us where to go. Okay, well, you know what, I really appreciate your time. And, you know, I know this is a terrible, a horrible issue for all of us to have to deal with. And I know that Senator Wyden is attempting to be on top of it as much as anybody can but I, I would suggest the message I'd leave for the senator is that really it would be a lot more comforting if we would have government updates like have our officials just come out and tell us so we're just not sitting here wondering you know when the axe is gonna fall do you know what I mean if we could hear what's going on there might be a lot less anxiety over it well thank you so much for your time you too bye bye Wow. Well, so you guys got that whole conversation. I'm going to hang up and post this up. And uh, evidently my little video of me videotaping it and posting it on Facebook was effective because I got right through. So there you go for uh, making sure that things work for yourself. There are ways to get it, you know, through the system. And I guess this is part of the post-ignorance project. We're a human rights organization. We're not an anti-nuke organization. It is our human right to know what the damage is that's being caused by the nuclear industry instead of them just twisting like pretzels in denial. And I'm going to keep posting videos and I hope uh, everybody else does the same and do what I do. Call your senators. Call your sen Congress people. Call your mayor. Call your local officials. And let them know that this is not an issue that we're forgetting about or that is forgetting about us. We're under direct threat from Fukushima every single day. Ciao, you guys.